Hi, this is April from Toronto, Ontario, and I would love to be the next Philly Angel. I have some good ideas. Let me know what you think. When you spend all day existing and refusing to conform, you need something to suck the soul back into your body. I'm not a goth mom! I like Philly dips because they can help you write better poetry. They can make it. <laughs> Life is so hard! <laughs> when you've had a hard day saving the turtles, sometimes you just need to unwind with Philly Light on celery. It's delicious! <laughs> Oh my god, like you could say, hashtag save the Philly. <laughs> I'm a clutter. I'm so happy to see you. I made cheesecake with Philly cream cheese. Of course you're vegan. How trendy. That's what all the young people are into, aren't they? Hmm. Well, I guess more for me. I love that. I'm used to eating my feelings because my son won't come visit. I like my partners the way I like my filly. <laughs> yes, it's true. Let's face it, you can't do better than the Philly Angel from the 90s. What you do need is realism. You need someone who represents the diversity of Canada and who also looks like she eats a lot of cream cheese. That didn't come out right. I actually love Philly so much that the prospect of doing multiple takes and eating Philly all the time makes me really happy. That's a lot of Philly. Okay. Um, I have been obsessed with the Philly Angel's hair since the 90s. I mean, look at my headshot. I would like any excuse to do the Philly Angel hair. This is a bagel. It's pronounced bagel. And this is what I consider the appropriate amount of cream cheese. All right, Philly, let's get real. I need redemption. My child and I have an excellent mother-daughter relationship, and that's really not healthy. I think if I were plastered all over the place representing Philly, she would suffer the humiliation she needs to be a well-adjusted person in society. I think this might also embarrass the in-laws. It's like...